Welcome back to my channel Gone Other Days where people were hooked to classic romance novel books. In today's era, our Gen Z kids are more interested in watching anime series. Fans now relate more to anime shows due to their gripping storyline, captivating visuals, and almost everything. Such is the case of The Chivalry of a Failed Knight. Based on a light novel series by Riku Misora and illustrated by One, the anime adaptation by Silver Link slash Nexus Studio First Time got aired in the year of 2015. The enchanting tale of Chivalry of a Failed Knight provides us a gateway to the fantasy world of the Blazers, a community of superhuman entities who can materialize weapons known as device through the energy of their soul. At the Hagen Academy, they are trained and later selected as representatives of the institution for the Seven Star Sword Art Festival. Hagen Academy is slowly losing its glamour and glory to its contemporaries, and thus the director of Hagen Academy, Hirono Shinguji, is now determined to find a solution to this problem. We can expect Chivalry of a Failed Night Season 2, if it happens to follow the same path as its previous season. The first season ended on an interesting note where Iki comes out to be the representative for the Hagen Academy, and later on goes on to propose the love of his life. A renewal of the show will possibly throw light on Iki and Stella, and other characters from the Academy training for the upcoming Seven Star Sword Art Festival. You have been waiting since ages for your favorite anime to return to the big screen again, haven't you? Well, you're not alone in this universe. We all have been waiting eagerly to know about the expected release date and time of the second installment of the anime show. The season one of the Chivalry of a Failed Knight takes us to the alternative world of superhumans known as Blazers, who have been blessed with superpowers to manifest weapons called devices from the energy of the soul. The Hagen Academy trains these Blazers and later selects them as representatives for the Seven Star Sword Art Festival, an annual tournament held by the Seven Mage Knight Academies in Japan to determine the strongest knight. Fast forward, the show introduces us to an F-rank blazer, Ikikuragain, who is a victim of mockery in the Institute for his poor magical skill. The first few episodes of The Chivalry of a Failed Knight take us to the world of Ikikuragain and show us his mediocre skills for which he is mocked. Nothing sort of extraordinary, the makers here focus more on fan service rather than building the depth of the characters. Hope you guys comma like this video will keep you updated comma if we get more details about the season 2 until then stay tuned. Do like share comment don't forget to subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon thanks for watching.